do that all the time. Like it's I don't know, is it a nervous thing? But like I just it's sway. It's an exciting thing. Yeah, I get excited. I'm, yeah. Hi. Hi. Stay here. Try more absinthe cocktails. Yay! <laughs> Remember it? No. Yeah, no. So I I know that I have drunk absinthe. Yeah. I don't remember drinking absinthe. Mm. I don't remember drinking an absinthe drink ever. I probably have had absinthe here. Maybe you, maybe you were absent that day. <laughs> I feel like you've got two absinthe enthusiasts here. I've never. I, besides like uh, drink roulette, I've never had like I've never been on an absinthe shoot. So really? about time. It looks so refreshing. Oh, it looks like all cucumber. Wow. I mean, is that a cucumber or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> this looks refreshing. Mm. Like a spritz. That looks gorgeous. It looks fabulous. You can smell the absinthe. If ever there's a cucumber in a drink, you know it's gonna be refreshing. And then afterwards you can do the whole thing. If there's absinthe in that, you might want to oh, put shit, it on yeah. your eyes. Okay, like that will, that will dissolve oh. your eyes. Ah. <laughs> Green beast. Ooh. Wow! That implies that's going to be very strong. It's my nickname when I drink this. <laughs> Aiden Green Beast with an E at the end of the green. Ooh. That's what they call me. The Green Beast, the Black Beast. They call me that. Look at that. Look at that. Watch me when I drink. Look at that. that. How is it? Oh. That's stunning. It's very aniseedy. Okay, so you're getting the uh, absent right up front there. Oh, wow. How much toothpaste is in this? That's gorgeous. I have no idea what's in it, though. Do you? I just taste absinthe and cucumber. A lot of people love absinthe and they really go on about it and it's this legendary thing, but it doesn't taste that fucking nice. Yeah. It tastes like shampoo. It tastes like fucking herbal essences. Mm. It's gorgeous. Like, water? <laughs> This actually makes it a lot more palatable. Mm. Green absinthe, honey. Mm. Okay. The full juice of one lime, uh, uh, four cucumber slices, uh, and chilled water. Oh my, oh my god! god. <laughs> you did better than me! Isn't it insane that we add a cucumber, the most tasteless vegetable, to add flavor? Stunning. An absinthe soaked cucumber. How every gal should start her day. I'm surprised. I'm really enjoying this. It does really taste like a hair product. I don't like the taste absent. No. I don't like the taste of licorice. I don't even like cucumber. And this is very good to me. It's just the sound of absolute heaven. I thought I was going to have a violent reaction against this. I don't really like absent from what I remember. Look, you're showing off so your emotions there. Do you see yourself going for a green beast anytime soon? Yeah. I am the green beast. You will never stop me, Chai Channel. <laughs> This looks absolutely beautiful. Oh. So me and you are the Irish barb and star go to Vista Del Mar. Yeah. La Tour Eiffel. La Tour Eiffel. Ooh la la. That's what I said to my uh, ma when she see me at the bottom of the stairs. Which is French for the orange drink. Ah, what a beautiful language. Yeah. Created by the light cocktail expert and author Gary Gaz Regan in 2007. He imagined what the Sazerac would be like if it were invented in France <gasps> instead of New Orleans. That's my favorite cocktail. Oh, sorry. sorry get, get, in fact, you're using the lemon as a bumper. <laughs> well, I played bumper cars before. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers. I'm super interested in this. That's uh, more savory. It's really nice. Oh, this is strong one now, that. You can taste the strength in that one, all right. A lot more than the other one. Oh, whoa, that smacks. There's Which probably is... like Angostura and something orange. It's like an Aperol. As any human who drinks this drink would say, that's a very strong drink. Never, never in my life. Taste anything like no. That. I would imagine either whiskey or cognac, but then I'm not sure because I can't really taste either of them. But there's something there that's warm. I don't know if I love it or hate it. Yeah, this is like, this is I'm new territory. Red absinthe, brandy, Cointreau, and topped up with some prosecco. Oh my! Holy God! Shit! So those most of those are alcohols, and then it's topped off. They're all alcohols, actually. Cool! Oh, Let's dude. go, girls. Bwah, 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 bwah. We should be wearing pantsuits and like kicking and everything like that. I can already feel it. Absinthe is just like, hello, I'm here. Don't know about you, Kira. We're having a good time. Don't know about you, but I love drinks. See, this is how Van Gogh was before he cut, chopped off his ear. Yeah, that's what happened to me, leg. <laughs> he used to have two legs <laughs> and then he drank some absinthe and then it was just all downhill from there. I mean, I don't hate it. I don't love it. I don't know how I feel but it's fun to, like it looks fun. Strongest drink I've ever drunk in my drinking, drinking, drinking But career. it doesn't taste strong. They're so yeah. different. I think I prefer, I would more reach for the other one. Mm. However, 
this is just this so will get you great. Drunker. This will get you to fuck up. Yeah. It looks like uh, a hotel in Vegas. It does. Do I hold it like this here? Like, please, sir, can I have some more? You can absolutely you... hold it at the stem because the stem's there to keep the glass colder. So, can I hold it like that though? <laughs> yes, you fucking can. Like a goblet. This bitch is ready to party. We don't deserve these fancy drinks. No, I feel like I am uh, the seventh alternative for James Bond. I am a drinker, right? Mm -hmm. And I have to say, whatever the fuck is in there, <laughs> I can feel it. This is called uh, The Sun Also Rises. Wow! Oh, that's so artistic. Ooh. So did a rent prices in Dublin, but that doesn't <sighs> stop me. That sounds like a prophecy, they, they, the sun also rises when the moon falls. We're contacting the spirits. <laughs> and also cheersing. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Oh, that's divine. Citrusy. That is good. Yeah. I am happy. Yeah. Oh my god, this is so fucked. <laughs> Ooh. Wow. Orange juice in that? That's amazing. Bit of orange. Pineapple rum, some peach liqueur, mm. some red absinthe, mm. lime juice, and grapefruit. I mean, oh. this is basically your five a day. I'm gorgeous. Love it. Ten divine. Out ten. ten out of ten. Sensational. Don't do that. <laughs> it's the best way to drink it, Jamie. Easiest by far. It's like, the best. Barely notice the absence. It's gorgeous. It's just a bit of, it's just a concoction of fruit flavors. It's fab. I love the first one. I first really like the first one. But can you say something that was cucumber was the best? No. To me, it tastes like a winter peach. I'm gonna get that tattooed on my back. <sighs> Beautiful. This is like a fucking, this is brilliant. Here is my big floppy hat. I want a big, big floppy hat and big sunglasses. I mean, you've already got something big and floppy. <laughs> hey! This is Ooh. called the Necromancer. Oh, oh the Necromancer! I've be had this strong. before, I've made this before. Yeah, it is, it's good though. Any drink that's called Necromancer is going to be lethal. And we're already drunk. A necromancer. What a dark name for such a bright drink. Yeah, yeah. Uh, thank God you ended that with Manser rather than Philia. I can't remember what's in it, but I know it's tasty. It smells Wait. like licorice again. I, I don't know what descriptions Wait. you're expecting here. This is fucking rocket fuel. Chin chin. That's a bit too strong with the absinthe. Yeah, there's a lot of absinthe. I mean, it's still very good. Oh, this is fizzier. This has got some sort of 7-Up or something in it. It's all light. So good. There's no alcohol in this. But I think the colour is more fun than the taste. I mean, it's yeah. the kind of thing I'd like to be photographed drinking. It still doesn't taste very alcoholic though, which is blowing my mind. Because I thought like something like this would just fucking destroy me. It's such a misunderstood spirit. It can be soft and like subtle and like flirty. It's not always like Kick you in the neck, punch you in the face. That's definitely a flirty one. Absinthe, uh, some vermouth, some gin, some lemon juice, and Jesus. some elderflower tonic. The tonic is what I'm get, getting the fizziness off. Wow. I do like the elderflower tonic. I'm surprised we, I didn't realize there was gin in this, but I think the absinthe just masks it. Now that you said, it is very florally. Both kind of have this kind of bitter flavor. Yeah. But it's two different kinds of bitter flavors. It is. Just like us. Two different kinds of bitter. Yeah, yeah, it's a bitterness that we keep in. If you feel like your night is kind of lagging a little bit and you want to have a drink that's a real pick-me-up, like that, Yeah. this would be the perfect drink. Yeah, they're all just really nice. I'm at the point that I'm like, they're all great. Um, I want to be friends with all of them. Actually, the more I drink this, I don't know if I'm just like drunker, but it's getting tasty. They're all really easy to drink. This is the problem. Your whole life has been leading up to this one moment this one moment you're where you're with, here us. with us. Can you not feel it? Feel this Fucking moment. Let us know in the comments if you can. Oh. Now drink it with me, Paddy, and we shall march on through life and they'll forever remember our names. You remember the time we did we the video where we had a, we had a good yeah, time and then afterwards that. we both went out and we fell. We fell and then our noses were squash. Oh. Squash. Squishy, squash. Oh. No, Is that bring all? Up, Do bring, we have one more? Bring them all back. Oh. I think it was because I came in and I don't like absinthe. I was like, this yeah. isn't going to be good. Yeah, I yeah, don't yeah. like absinthe. But these were fun. They were fruity. I think I liked the first one the most just because it had the most distinctive absinthe taste. Yes. Because I'm like, ooh, licorice. I have to say now, 
I've drank a lot of stuff on this channel. You, uh, you know, apart from the whiskey calendar, mm -hmm. uh, this has been the most alcoholic of the holliest of alcohol drinks I've tried. And I fucking loved every it moment was. of it. So thank you very much. Hey, did you enjoy this? Well, maybe next time, if you subscribe, you'll find out more about us. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I loved it! <laughs> that was really good! To find out more about us, subscribe. Amazing. That oh. was fantastic. <laughs>